hello you guys welcome back to my channel this is a unit I just finished I wasn't really planning on doing a video or anything on it but when I posted a picture of halfway through the progress I had a few friends ask to post a few pictures of the ending results I figured why not do you one better and post a video this is a 20 inch a 16 inch and a 14 inch and the 12 inch closure the closure actually came straight but I took my winding curl which is red by kiss um, I'm not sure the size but I took my winding curl and I curled the closure I know the curls don't really match the hair but by the time I walk outside I live in Pensacola Florida so of uh, this weather will help the curls fall just the way I need it to this is a sewn unit not a glue gun unit like I usually do just a sewn unit and I put oh gosh you can't see that my dark and lovely all natural anti shrinkage souffle on it I did not put a lot I did not want it weighed down I literally put a little bit on my fingers and ran my fingers through the strands just like that this hair is very manageable I finished the unit last night y'all don't be mad at me but yeah I finished the unit last night and I literally had 10 minutes to get to work and I wore her to work last night before I could take any pictures or anything like that I had to snatch it off and go also I this is my first time trying out the um Japanese mesh Japanese mesh swim cap when I say this thing is so awesome this is my second unit doing it with the Japanese mesh swim cap the first unit was of the unit I did with um, the hair from that was sent to me from Brooklyn she sent a Japanese mesh cap to go with it and I'm using another one for my unit and when I say I have always been one of the a comb girls, clip girls, whatever, sewn into my wigs. But, oh my gosh. <laughs> this thing was not going anywhere. Like, I don't even have clips on it right now. And it's not going anywhere. Soon, uh, in the next few days, I'll post a few pictures with it on. And if you have any more questions about it, then um, leave it in the comment area and I'll be sure to make a video about it. This is not the last video I'm doing on this hair. I want to tell you guys more about this hair, but I need more time and I'm getting ready for work now. So I can't do it right now at this moment. But if you leave a message for me in the description box, like I said, whatever you want to know about this hair what do I do to manage it and everything then just leave it in the description leave it in the comment box and I'll answer all of your questions at once in another video this upcoming weekend very beautiful hair I did a lot of work last night when I went to work so and she she held on y'all she held on with me again this is a 20 16 14 and a 12 inch closure and wand curls. I took I took the closure and I took some of the hair and I wanted them both together. So like I said, whenever I walk outside, the hair, the curls will fall perfectly and blend in with the rest of the hair. So I'm not really worried about that. I'm wait I'm still waiting on my closure for this one. I haven't ordered it yet, but I, I am going to very soon order the closure from the hair company that sent this. Um I'm not trying to be stingy or anything like that. I just um, want to test it out and everything and have more details for you guys before I actually try to talk about this hair. Um, I guess that's about it. If you like it, like I said, let me know. If you don't like it, let me know. If you want to know more about the hair, again, comment in the description box. And this weekend, Saturday, I will leave a video answering everyone's questions all at once isn't that so beautiful like I said I used the souffle but I did not use a lot and I shook her around a little bit you know Tina Turner her <laughs> shook her around um, 
so I can bring these curls back to life and, you know, get some body and bounce in it. But, yeah, that's all I did. Look out for the video this weekend and don't forget to subscribe. And thank you guys for following. Bye-bye.